I'm Paul and this is Jamie. Hi, thanks for watching. Yes, in case you're just tuning in for the first time. So today's the day we're finally going to build the suspension bridge from the platform we're standing on to the platform behind us. All right, wish us luck, incident free. Yes. <laughs> thanks. like arachnophobia in here. Those are big spiders. This is a job for Jamie. Oh boy. Well, I ain't really going in there, but I'll drag this box out. You're I'm take, not wrestling those things. You're going to take one of them with you. <laughs> I guess so. Who oh, bails? Lord. He's going to bail. I'm going to bail. You're right. Oh. We might have to just burn this place down. <laughs> that big guy's going to want to get out. Get out of that box. Oh, Lord. Why isn't he getting out? I don't know. Probably has a few friends in there. Yeah, he needs to get out. I'm not gonna kill him. I don't, no, don't, I don't kill like him. killing bugs. But... Just relocate him. Okay, go, go. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh he can move fast. Good. Nice. What is that there? Come on. Up, up. There we go. Up and out. He's gone. Quick little side project. Let me just put up a storage unit so we can get some stuff out of storage to get it here. All had to uh, grease up the tractor. It's been a while, so every joint gets a little, a little uh, extra, extra love, so it'll keep moving. So before we get started, we have to cut down two of these trees because they're in the way of the, the suspension bridge. It's going to be four feet wide. So we're going to take these two outermost trees and hopefully land them over there. We'll see. I was positioning the tractor so that we can um, hopefully use the bucket to keep it from falling on our newly built uh, storage shed that we're using for a while.
All right, the first thing I'm gonna do, you see these two trees behind me? I'm gonna set up a, a string or a center line from this back tree all the way over to the tree on the treehouse platform on that far left corner. So once we determine the center point, we can measure off each side two feet. That's roughly where the half inch cables are gonna go. You can barely see it, but so we've established our center line for the most part. So now we'll measure two feet to the left, two feet to the right, and that's where the those brackets down there, four of them, will go up here. All right, I'm gonna have my put my first bracket on. And my thought was I had these cut at a local steel mill in Manchester, New Hampshire. I think they're three-eighths structural steel. So my thought was put a bolt on the bottom and the top, which corresponds to the top and bottom of this beam. So these two plates will kind of sandwich this beam. And then this top hole with my it's kind of like a guide hole for the uh, for the half-inch cable. So hopefully this is strong enough to hold everything together. And this will not only hold them at the correct height, but also the correct distance, since the cable is going to taper back uh, to wrap around this tree behind me. So that's the plan anyway. We'll see how uh, how well this works. Yeah, that's roughly in position. All right, and I've got to put the last joist in up there. My double joist, so. sent to retrieve the 25 foot cable which is right there I imagine on top oh it's heavy you sure that's not gonna spring open no. it's gonna send us flying oh, yeah oh, not bad. Oh. Not bad. Looks like it's going to line up pretty good. Oh, the cord isn't in there. I no, thought it was. No. That would have been bad. So I decided that um, while Paul's busy up above trying to uh, get the suspension bridge holes drilled, that I would organize our shed there so that maybe we can find stuff and things aren't just tossed on the ground and mixed in with leaves and you just can't find anything. Anyway, um, I'm not as afraid of spiders as Paul is, but I still don't want them to be my friends. And apparently we are in battle with them because I just had a big guy come and get me while moving uh, concrete bags that have turned into giant bag shaped rocks now. I was hoping to get a picture of him, but I think maybe he retreated. I could be that lucky. All right, we finally got the cable in for the first platform. I'll show you real quick. This bracket is just kind of loose, loose at the moment, but it's roughly four feet apart from the one over there. You can see that's done. And initially I was gonna keep this 
on the same plane and run it through all the joists and around the tree, but after thinking about it a little bit more, it seemed to make more sense to lower the cable on the tree so it's a little stronger and I don't compromise, you know, half a dozen joists. So it's just a hole through this one, uh, that one, and the very bottom of the third one here. Goes down around the tree. Like I said, it's loose right now. We don't have any pressure whatsoever on it. Got one spacer in there. Got three more to put in, but it's just in there temporarily. And it comes out over the back yoke. And out through the front. And then we're working on the treehouse platform today. So the idea behind these brackets are essentially just to keep it they're kind of pinched on the um, the, the front yoke here. They're 3 8 steel, so hopefully, hopefully they're strong enough. They should be. The 3 quarter inch grade A bolts holding them top and bottom. So that'll keep it kind of pinched against the yoke, maintaining that four foot distance. And then also to help keep the elevation of the cable correct or where it should be. All right, these are the plates we designed for the treehouse platform. Same width, thickness, they're just a little taller because the glue lamb is 15 or 14 and a half inches tall, so that's essentially the distance between this bottom hole and the top hole for, for our bolts. And this will be the guide hole for the, for the cable. All right, we got the two brackets temporarily in. Hi, so we're we're all done. It's Sunday, six o'clock, and yep. uh, we we're, run out of steam. Yeah, we're tired. We ended up spending half the day today moving stuff from our old storage unit to the new storage unit here on the property. So that chewed up a little more time than we thought. Yeah, but so. we got quite a bit quite a bit of stuff done this weekend. We're pretty happy. We've got all the cables run, all the brackets are in. Um, so the next part of this video, I think, we'll be putting deck on the platform behind us, yes. and then we'll. Then we'll the, be starting the stanchions. Yeah, putting the stanchions the up for the bridge. Um, so hopefully in a few weeks we'll have this thing done. Fingers crossed. Yes. So So please uh, remember to like and subscribe and thanks for watching. Yes, thanks. I don't want to kill spiders, I don't want to kill bees. I will kill a hornet. wants to have a Mexican standoff with me. Does he have spider babies in here? I'm Jamie. I'm Paul. <laughs> she bats me in the back. Um, like, go in the woods! Don't you want to go in the woods? Get away from me. I have sharp things. That was awful. I'm going to start again. Go run! Go away! Keep going that way. Go, 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 go,